and unworthy Thor makes many futile attempts to lift Mjolnir. He then tries to leave the hammer, but no matter where he wanders, Mjolnir follows. He begins punching Mjolnir until the Thunderer tells him this is not how you throw a punch. You're punching with rage, not focus, so you will end up hurting yourself more than the thing you strike. The Thunderer decides to teach Thor how to throw a punch. They teleport to the hidden city of Kunlun, and Thunderer explains the power of Iron Fist is here, and it's without a living vessel. Thor begins training to become the Iron Fist by punching Mjolnir, the strongest substance in all the realms, strong enough to break the bones of gods. After 30 days of punching Mjolnir, Thor's fist became like hammers. As Mjolnir began to crack, it tried to dodge Thor's blows. This encouraged Thor to punch even harder. Then Mjolnir started fighting back, but Thor eventually defeated Mjolnir's spirit. Then Thunderer punches Thor and says that defeating the hammer wouldn't make him worthy of the Iron Fist. He must now defeat the Thunderer himself. Thor sent the Thunderer flying with a mighty punch. The Thunderer said he has never felt such a perfect punch before. Thunderer explains that it was an honor to lead Thor to his destiny, but that he lied. He did not train Thor to wield the power of the Iron Fist or any weapons except the ones he was born with. Thor becomes the god of fists and is ready to fight the masters of evil.